Hello and welcome to another Advanced Skeleton video. In this video, we're going to take a closer look at MoCap X. I just want to be free and do whatever I want. So, MoCap X is a really cool uh, application that you can get from the App Store to run on your iPhone 10. Now the iPhone 10 is equipped with a depth camera which allows uh, applications such as uh, MoCap X to record your facial expressions and have this translated and sent into Maya and use this essentially to do a facial capture. I just want to be free and do whatever I want. So in this video we're going to take a look at how we can use MoCap X together with Advanced Skeleton. Note that on the MoCap X website there is already a tutorial here that shows MoCap X and Advanced Skeleton working together. And today in this video, uh, we're going to be doing a very similar thing. We're going to connect MoCap X with Advanced Skeleton Face Setup. So let's start out in the beginning. Now, as what we'll be doing here is to apply animation, we will start off with referencing in our rig. Now, this is usually a good idea for anything animation related, referencing your rig so that you can get updates later on if the rig has any updates that you want to bring into your animation. So let's go ahead and create reference. And we will choose our tuna character for this video. Note that MoCap X has both the ability to read a performance capture clip as well as a real time option allowing you to connect your iPhone directly into Maya for real time facial capture. Now, first thing uh, we'll do here is to read a clip. We're going to go ahead and uh, read in the sample clip that comes with MoCap X and apply that to our character here. So we downloaded and installed the MoCap X for Maya, which gives us this shelf with these buttons. And one of these is called Create a Clip Reader. So we'll go ahead and hit that. We'll then uh, pop open the outliner, select our MoCap X node and open the attribute editor. And here we can see we got the clip reader and we can browse that to a motion capture clip. So we'll go ahead and browse to the clip that comes with mocap X. We now have the clip in the scene. We just got to connect it to advanced skeleton. Now there is a shortcut way of doing this. You can open the uh, selector, any of the selector or pick a tools. Under the anim drop down menu, there is a function called connect mocap X. And then we can hit play on the timeline. And sure enough, that has connected our facial capture clip. We'll also go ahead and drag in the sound that belongs to that clip. And we'll go ahead and play it. I just want to be free and do whatever I want. Now, as that clip has the voice of a girl, uh, we might just switch the character over to uh, being one of the female demo characters. Now, since we used referencing, that becomes quite easy. We'll just go into the reference editor and choose replace reference. And instead of tuna, we'll pick uh, Clary. I just want to be free and do whatever I want. And that's it. That's how we can quickly connect the mocap X to a advanced skeleton face setup. I hope you have enjoyed this video and I'll see you next time.